Welcome to next chapter video. Hello there. How are you doing? I hope you are doing great. After a long time, I am going to make an episode. And this is a very special video. Why? Because I am going to make a video for the future leaders. So who are the future leaders? Can you guess? Yes, the students are the future leaders in our country, in the world. Well, for the future leaders, I have a question. So would you like to know the question? The question is, what is the major responsibility of a student? Well, I'm going to give you five seconds. Think and tell me what is the major responsibility of a student. Thank you. Thank you for helping me. Well, are you thinking debate is the major responsibility of a student? Yes, debate helps a student to know the unknown. By debating, one can improve his communication ability. By debate, one can know some data. But is it the major responsibility for a student? This is my question. Well, see, the next one is sports. Yes, sports are really helpful for, for keeping the body fit, for making healthy body. But is it the major responsibility of a student? But let's see, social media. Social media is made for what? For building network. So if you have social media in your hand, you can have good communication with the people inside the country and the outside the country. So you may think social media is everything. For a student, that is my question. Is it the major responsibility of a student? Well, hangout. Yes, hangout helps to be refresh men, right? To be refreshed ourselves. But is it the major responsibility of a student? Traveling. By traveling, we can see the unseen, we can know the unknown. But is it the major responsibility of a student? Speech contest. Yes, by speech contest, one can do what? One can know how to talk before lots of audience. He can know how to captivate the audience. He can know how to deliver his speech, his talk. But is it the major responsibility of a student? Study, reading and writing. These are the two skills which are really very important for a student. Are these the major responsibility of a student? Well, let's see. I'm going to give you a shocking news. That is, if you know debate very well, so to me, I'm going to give you just zero. Why? See, debate is zero. Why it is, I'm going to tell you later. Speech contest, the value is zero. Traveling, value is zero. Drawings, hangout, sports, and social media. Everything is zero. This is my perception. Why? I'm going to establish it. Let's see. Yes, study. This is the major responsibility of a student to me. Why I'm telling that? Let's take an example. Suppose the, the companies of our country or the, you can say the, like the, the companies of outsiders, they have given an advertisement on newspaper. They want to hire an employee. You'll see some requirements are given there. There are lots of requirements, but what is the major requirements there? That a candidate has to have like masters, MBA, these are the things, right? So if you don't have masters, if you don't have honors, if you don't have MBA or BBA, how come you submit your CV? That's why I think study is the number one thing. So what are the uses of those skills like debating, speech contents? Are these the things which are just waste of time? No, I don't think so. I never say that. See, this is also, these are the things also very important for a student. Well, study is number one word and the debate is equal zero. I said it earlier. Right? When study comes first and debate comes later, it will be 10. Are you happy now? Well, let's see that next one. See, study is one, debate zero, speech contest zero. So when study comes first, then debate comes later, then speech contest comes next. 
So it has been 100. Isn't it really fantastic information? Yes, I think so. Let's see. Well, so as a student, where we need to focus? We need to focus on study. If you focus on study, you can be competent competitor in this world, in this competitive world. So my dear students, please, please focus on your study. If you focus on your study, you do other things, no problem. That these skills will be valuable for you. So this is all for today. And I'm going to make another episode, which is very important. And this episode is all about evaluation. So please wait for that things. And with that, thank you very much.